What kind of gets you is just kind of the banality of it. The guards who are doing this look like robots. They don't look angry, really. They're just doing their job. They treated individuals, young men, both black and non-black, as if it was worse than a military training camp. The fact that we put students in these facilities and we leave them there because the turnover rate and the recidivism rate is very high back to those same facilities. Then what happens, it becomes a pipeline to the jailhouse. This particular case was simply the tip of the iceberg. They went to a system for help and that system killed the child. There is absolutely no way we can excuse that. There's solutions, I, I don't I, know. Can you prevent evil from happening? I don't think so. Can you, can you prevent accidents from happening? I doubt it. I mean, these things happen. It's, it's what we do with it afterward that defines us as a society. And what we do to prevent that future recurrence. I mean, that's, that's the key. tragic of the things that happened, but you know, this is just one of the things that came to the light. You know, when it came come down to prisons and reform schools and that type of thing, of the abuse that these kids and people have to go through sometimes. Yeah, the last time we was here, we caught a little action in here where one of the doors slammed. Me and my daughter was inside when it happened. Uh, um, we was actually coming out this room here, and as you can see, there's no door here. Um, from this side over here, Doors open today. So I brought one of my little toys with me. So we're gonna play with it a little while and see if we get some communication. I'm gonna set it right here. And as you can see, there's no reading on it. So is there any presence or any body that would like to communicate? The last time I was here, you slammed the door. Could you please do that again? These are some of the stoves that they was using during the, when the facility was open. See, the last time we came, I believe it was this door here that slammed. And we had came back in. To 
try to get it to slam. And actually, it's more windier today than it was that day. And you can see it's wide open. So, would you want us to leave? Would you like us to leave? If there's a present here? Would you like anyone to know that you're still here? Why would you want to stay here, though? This wasn't the best place. But maybe that's all they know. The last time we tried to come through here, we didn't realize the back door was open or busted or whatever the case may be. Yeah, so we're going to go in through this side this time. Yeah, as you can see, this was where the doctor will park at or whatever. You know, before that door was had the gurney in it. Things okay. Yeah, this way the x-ray room was. Yeah, take everything out, yeah. All right, everybody. That does it for this little short video. As you can see, this is it. Um, didn't have yeah. too many, much, I didn't, didn't have any. Didn't have no activity. Any See you guys later. That's it for this video. Check out our next oh, yes. video. Don't forget to like and subscribe and also share. Thank share. you. Thanks, guys. Peace.